Welcome, everybody, to another Voice of Nick show. We're doing more of our Post America artwork. We're going to be mostly uh, merging layers here. We're in the process of merging from the bottom up. We have these figures. We're going to just keep going <clears throat> and uh, keep moving forward. We'll lose this. We'll merge this. And this is its own thing. None of these have masks, which is nice. What's going on here? Ah, that's what it is. So, how do we figure this out? So we have items that need to cut into the background layer. I think this is gonna work actually. No, wait, yeah, all, all we would have to do is, first we're gonna merge these two. We don't need them to be separate. And we're gonna cut this into here. And, oops, and also, oh, and cut it into here. And cut it into here. Now when we delete this, it should work. because it's, it's not a problem with the bow and arrow, it's a problem with the figure below it. Which is why we should really be breaking out these groups. guys. We'll break out this group. Welcome uh, WX into the show. We are making our book illustrations. Okay, so let's go take this, delete this. These can get merged. This, now this is the same thing where we need to, if we put it all in the same layer first, then we don't have to go through this whole process. Nope, didn't work. And why not? If we delete this, what does that look like? Maybe it didn't do the deletion? That should have worked. Okay. I see what it is. So the interesting situation with this is that the... Okay. 
let's go back until before we had that. Now, what it is, is that we need to have, I still don't see why this wouldn't work. We need this to cut into here and then cut into here And that is doing that. And why is that? It is because Where does this exist? Is there another layer? Nope. If we're cutting this shape out of this, how would this not? Okay, now for some reason it worked. Nope. Wait, if we turn this off. Yeah, okay, it worked. I don't know what was going wrong, but we were right the whole time. It's just that it didn't want to work, I guess. Okay, we can merge this also with the background layer. Good. So now all these guys are working. Welcome Zer Tundra to the show. Hanging out lurking. Welcome in. Let's delete that little section there. Okay, now we have the second layer, I think. Yep. And we can delete all the extraneous stuff before we break it out. And WX saying. Well, it looks cool. Appreciate it. Okay, let's break this out. Now this is going to get merged. This will get cut out of here. This is what gets merged. These two can merge. And then this gets cut. Now we have this whole upper section. Good. Now we're just going to clean this up real quick. Any layers with masks, we're going to rasterize the masks out of there. We're going to delete any hidden layers. <clears throat> we can merge anything like that. This needs a new thing too. Good.
after this. Now we have the whole horse for Menelaus. Delete that. Merge that. Now, why can't I destroy this group? I can. Okay. Yeah, this is a lot simpler if we just keep everything on one layer when we're doing this final stage. Okay, now this layer is almost every figure. Let's um, consolidate or save it. Make sure that everything is up to this point, good to go. Check Agamemnon, turn off his extra stuff. And real quick, I just want to give him a little bit larger of a character. Because he's like extremely short compared to everybody else. Um, just because his uh, horse is so big. Or the horses in general are so big, so he has to be smaller. We'll try and get him a little bit larger there. Alright, we didn't lose a lot of detail. Good. We do our thing. Delete all this. Delete that. Merge. Cut. Merge. Delete. All right, now all we need is Thetis. Merge this. Merge this. Everything still looks normal. That's good. Let's just take a quick look and see if, if we like this. That's kind of the design language we did for characters who encroach on the background. Yeah, that works better.
Nope, something didn't work. And what was that that didn't work? Aha! It's because this entire group has a mask. That makes it a little bit complicated because we have to... We might just have to recreate the mask. There's nothing we can do. We can, well, what we can do is, this is gonna copy the layer. Select, nope, that selects everything. Can I pull out the mask? Nope. Uh, yeah, we might as well just redo it. Okay, so, we're gonna destroy this group, which is then gonna put the vase in front of her. So first things first, we can get rid of this. This can get merged, that wouldn't matter, I don't think. It's really just this that we need to worry about. Ah, but the problem is, yeah, we can't do that. Okay, what can we do here? What we have to do is erase Okay, we turned off the mask here. We basically just have to erase twice. It's not that hard to do. And this only really concerns uh, the black areas, I think. So we're good there. Now for this, we want to do the same, but for the red areas. Okay, now we can delete this mask. We have to put these back at 100 before we put them in the picture. Um, and also this doesn't look very good, so. So, why does this, ah, it's because, okay, we 
just got to trust the process. Basically, this is going to delete sections we don't want to delete, but then we're going to be adding those sections back in. This is a layer of black. Yep. Merge that, merge that, merge that. Then this can go. This gets merged, this gets cut. These three things get merged. Okay. Now we have a fully merged thing and let's just duplicate it. I don't even really know why we would duplicate it at this stage, but damn, I couldn't cancel this. All right. There's one thing I wanted to do when I was looking at the picture, uh, this one of Eurypolis. I want to change something. It should be not too hard to do. You know what I think it is, is that, uh, that's the wrong direction. We want to make this darker, not lighter in the corners.
doesn't really matter what color we paint this with because it's getting tra transformed into the new color. We're just uh, filling in the bottom parts anywhere that it is like digitally flawed. In some places we intentionally masked it, but there are certain spots where you can tell that it's not intentional. Good. That's the difference between this and this. So let's call this book for version seven. And with that, we are ready to start weathering this picture uh, finally pretty excited about that. We're going to start that on the next one, ladies and gents. Thanks for joining. The channel is called The Voice of Nick. If you want to see more, don't forget to hit the follow button, and I'll see you next time.